Hi, my name is Dimitri and in this video we'll see how the screenshotting feature in Clockify works and how you can manage it. Clockify helps you recall what you worked on with the screenshots feature. It's only available for desktop users. So, first things first, let's install the desktop Clockify app and then log into your account from there. In order to use the screenshotting feature, it first needs to be enabled in the workspace settings. Find the Capture Screenshots option in the settings and turn on the switch. Now, all members will be notified via both the web app and the desktop app that this feature has been activated. By default, screenshots are blurred. So if you want to capture high-resolution screenshots right from the start, mark this option as well. Once you start your timer, screenshots will be captured randomly in 5-minute intervals, while the timer is running and the desktop app is active. Screenshots won't be taken if the duration of a time entry is less than 5 minutes, or if the timer is running on the web or mobile, instead of on desktop. If you want to review your screenshots, click on the three dots and then click on the Screenshots option. This will lead you to the web app, where you can revise and manage your screenshots. You can click on a screenshot to open a gallery view, and then go back and forth between the screenshots. You'll see the time when it was recorded, as well as the name of a project, task, and client, if it's available. To see screenshots for other days, click on the arrows in the upper right corner next to the date. Here you can go back up to one year from the time when the screenshot was taken. To delete a screenshot, click on the bin icon that appears when you hover over it, and then confirm the action by clicking Delete. Screenshots are tied to time entries, so deleting screenshots will impact the time entries. If you have the role of a regular user and your entry only has one screenshot, the whole entry will be deleted. And if an entry is related to multiple screenshots, the time between that and the screenshot before it will be subtracted from the time entry's total time. This works in the reverse way too. If an entry is deleted, the screenshots that are related to it will also be deleted. Just a side note, if you want to see who works on what in real time, you can go to the team dashboard. Here you will see all of the active timers and what they're working on. Also, users can add and edit entries manually by themselves. If you wish to disable this option so that they only start and stop the timer without being able to change the time, go to the workspace settings, permissions, and then enable force timer. The screenshotting feature cannot be activated without notifying the users. So all members in the workspace will know when the feature is activated. Regular users can see and delete all of their personal screenshots, while admins can see and delete everyone's without subtracting the time from the entry. All active users in the workspace will be listed here, and next to each person, admins can see their total number of recorded screenshots on that day. And then they can review the screenshots. If time entries are locked or approved, only admins will be able to delete screenshots related to them. Unless high-resolution screenshots have been allowed in workspace settings, all screenshots will be blurred. If you want to learn more about the desktop app or tracking activity in Clockify, make sure to check out our other tutorials. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.